Good morning, I'm Earth Doctor Reese Halter, and you're listening to EarthCast, SOS.com. A wild forest is a lush, living, vibrant landscape in the eyes of New Zealand law. Te Uriwera was granted legal personhood to resolve a dispute over who owned it, the government or local Maori peoples. This is a profound alternative to the human presumption of sovereignty over the natural world. The same will be true of the Wanganui River. It means the areas have stronger legal protection. Te Uriwera is a legal entity and has all the rights, powers, duties, and liabilities of a legal person, and lawsuits can be filed on their behalf. It's the most revolutionary piece of legislation anywhere in the world. In 2008, Ecuador was the first country to codify the rights of nature's principle in its constitution. And it's gaining credence elsewhere too, Bolivia and India, as local and global environmental crises worsen, Calls are increasing for nature to be protected as comprehensively as humans are. We come from the land, and the land has its own personality, its own heartbeat, its own health, and its own soul. Ladies and gentlemen, what we do to nature, we do to ourselves. It's time to hashtag save nature now. Hashtag love nature. Hashtag love is the solution. Earthcast SOS depends upon you, the listeners. So don't be shy. Come on to drreese.com. D-R-R-E-E-S-E.com. Scroll to the bottom of the page and click on that donate button. And pick yourself up any number of terrific books on bees, trees, seas, wild weather, and life. The wonder of it all. Just do it. DrReese.com. I'm Earth Doctor Reese Halter, reminding you to protect our planet.